serving up such great weather today for you to get out for a walk. If you're going to be close to somebody, uh, you know the deal. It's all masks all the time. Again, they are everywhere for a good reason. Uh, Rachel Carey is the uh, chair of the Media Studies Program at Caldwell University. She's been talking to her students and doing some research on how wearing masks is changing the way we communicate. I dislike wearing masks very much. <laughs> dislike or hate? Not hate. I wouldn't say hate because I understand that it's necessary. But uh, they do become annoying. I have an accent, so sometimes the way I pronounce words is different. If I say a word differently, kind of, maybe people wouldn't catch what I'm saying. It's kind of hard in that sense. I think people have to compensate for the fact that whoever they're talking to is going to get less information about what they're trying to say, what they mean. And you can compensate by adjusting other things you do, like exaggerating your tone of voice or slowing down a little bit more than you might usually, and of course, speaking louder as well. Now I communicate in other ways, like, you know, with my eyes, uh, with hand gestures as well. So I've kind of like adapted to it. I definitely believe eye contact is the main source for you to understand that they're getting your message. So if they're just looking over the place or they're on their phone, I find it really hard for me to follow on the words because sometimes they mumble or go too high or too soft. So you have to really be engaged in the conversation. I think if we get more awareness about looking for signs that we've communicated effectively, that's good training for other situations as well. Are you going to miss wearing a mask when they finally say <laughs> we don't have to wear them anymore? <laughs> no, but I think because of how normalized it has been right now, I think not wearing it might feel awkward. All right, two takeaways there. I like what Rachel says about how if we really focus on communicating better, when the masks do come off, we're all going to be better communicators. And then, wow, I wonder how many people are going to miss or feel awkward without a mask. Only time will tell as we uh, continue to mask up. And uh, everybody still tells me they're smiling behind it whenever we take our pictures. But right now, we'll send things, uh, we'll put Cindy right back in the picture. What do you think? I think it's really interesting. And I, I like the idea when they were saying to put down the phones when you're talking, because you know how sometimes people are. Yeah. Yes. texting and talking so maybe we the good idea to just you have to focus more to to know you're communicating there you go that's right <laughs> john yep. thank you